All right, into losers finals here between Zephyril and Rasmew here at Hypertension. All right, that uh, the Waterfall is going to go ahead and work out. Bop him out with Fire Punch, surprisingly. Looks like he canceled it. It will snag him out of Blizzard. Ooh, not able to snag a vulnerable frame there. Jeffrey just keeping up the counterattack spam. Oh, all right. The fact that it crossed over helped him. Able to punish the Hydro Pump attempt. Let's go for a grab, gonna crush it. Oh no, he goes for the follow-up and unfortunately that is his undoing as uh, Zephyril is able to punish with uh, Seismic Toss on the landing. Able to counter in time against Fire Punch. Hale's gonna bop him out of air. Uh, bomb the flare blitz. Able to counter through it, goes for the burst attack. I don't know if it'll snag. No, able to block in time. Blocks against fire or flare blitz, excuse me, and able to punish. Combos into it. Snag that counter up. Rasmew is bopping him out of air. Oh, tries to go for a grab. Counter's in time. Nice. Rasmew's going to snag round two. Zephyrial able to not only snag the Nugget, ooh, snag the Nugget and also the uh, Face Shift. He's also going to get that Seismic Toss against the Dragonite Call. Able to counter in time, though. Flare Blitz is going to land. To uh, block in time against Fire Punch. Anti-ears beautifully. Ooh, risky. Push into duel. That's great synergy to bump back. Gotta be careful at this point. Just try to suspend his burst. Uh, oh! All right, doesn't carry into the animation though, so no extra damage. Able to snuff the counterattack. Oh, tries to call out a jump, and oh, flare blitz is just gonna barely snag him there, and actually snag the kill. So uh, Zephyril. Taking game one. This is the best of five, so we'll see if um, Raspy can turn this around.
hammering the use of uh, Mirror Coat there. Good punish there from Zephyril. He tried to see it, you see a little too early. Blizzard's gonna just bop that Flare Blitz out of the air. Raspy trying to go for that full charge homing. Zephyril able to um, counter in time. Well, bop it, rather. Zephyril going for the burst. Going for counter in time. Goes for the Dragonite. And Zephyril is going to be able to avoid it, but does take a few hits from the Hydro Pump. Not sure why he did Seismic Toss there. Might have been an input. Or miss input. Why is he? Oh, the Aurora Beam's going to snag him. It was a good cancel out of the uh, Water Gun into um, Flight Stance, but the, not being able to block that Aurora Beam in time. Fortunately, it didn't end. Ooh, both the players trying to go for a grab. Rasmus actually going to take it first. Goes for Dragonite. That will catch him out of air. Get a bit of a restand first. Good combo there. Making use of the situation. Water Gun's going to catch. Goes for a meaty Hydro Pump. Oh my gosh. Empty hop into grab. Dang, Icy Wind is going to snag a vulnerable frame. Ask me going ahead and activating synergy. Water guns catching them just at the right moment. Yeah, not able to block in time. Rasmi is going to snag with his burst attack and take game two. Both of these players at one one now. See who can get the advantage here in game three. All right, into game three here. Able to snag that fire punch in on the vulnerable frame. Tries to go for a seismic toss. Oh! Fortunately, using that upward counterattack, it punished. Goes for Blizzard. Fire Punch is going to be able to counter all the way through it. A little bit of a high low situation there. Has me already in a tight spot. Oh, all right. Catches the CADC with the fire punch. So Zephyr is going to take round one with a perfect. Tries to call a side shot. Let's it rip a little early there to catch. Oh, no. Goes for the upward counterattack. So Zephyr is going to punish it. Oh, tries to go for a headbutt, unfortunately. A little misspaced there. So Zephyr will grab that. CDCs. He's getting caught by him now. Zephyr's going to activate Synergy. Oh, I think he can block in time. No, he can't. The ending lag on the jump. That actually might do it. Oh my god, 3 HP remaining. Gonna run up there, activate synergy. Snags an Aurora Beam. Dragonite gonna call, go ahead and call out. Oh no! Oh! Had he gone for the upward counterattack first, it would have snagged, but unfortunately, didn't see that coming. 
followed into the attack, possibly on accident. But Zephyrio will go ahead and punish with the grab. Snag game three. Zephyrio now in advantage here in losers finals. Unfortunately, Hale's not going to interrupt Fire Punch in time. No, oh, bit of a uh, trade there. Zephyrill ended up taking more damage. Able to snag the CADC. Counters the time against Flare Blitz. Gets the follow up. Homing attack working out for. Water gun at the last second getting eaten up by Flare Blitz. So a quick poke into a seismic toss. Activate that synergy. Pump some of that pressure back. Go ahead and call out that Dragonite. Not going to be able to block that in time. Finish it off with the Eat. Hey. I think. I don't know. Upward of Warrior Beam. Attack, which will go ahead and take uh, some uh, synergy away, which is very important in this matchup. Don't you know that Charizard getting the uh, burst attack. It's very easy for them to do so. Mmm, Clash! Zephyr's gonna go ahead and activate that uh, EV. enough grab, excuse me. Let's go for a meaty grab. 15 HP remaining, gotta be careful here. Bop him out of the fire punch. Raspy is going to take game four, pushing it to game five. We'll see who takes this. I apologize, our headset is just acting all sorts of up right now. Try to see ADC grab, but Zephyrl going in for that forward. Why? That's for me to counterattack. Able to counter through the bite attempt and CADC grab. Icy Wind's gonna snag vulnerable frames. Ooh, catching vulnerable frames there with that flare blitz. That one's gonna work out against Fire Punch. Except for activated Eevee gets some. Send for the follow up. Didn't hold it, so yes, you can counter Blizzard, but that was a little mistimed. Rasty gonna go ahead and snag that waterfall back into dual phase, keep the pressure on. Oh, punishes the counterattack. I don't know if Zephyrl meant to let that rip or not. Gets the grab. Goes for the Dragonite. It is going to trade, but he's going to, you know, land it and still combo on the getup. All right. Rasmew. Still making it work. Snags a waterfall.
Oh, man, some uh, very swift dodging there. Oh, no, goes into the follow-up, which is going to get punished by the Seismic Toss. Ooh, Flare Blitz going to snag. Goes for that 5 charge X, er, 5X. Charge 5X, excuse me. Surprised that he's not, oh, okay. All right, we're going to get a guard break. That takes some synergy away. No, oh, Flare Blitz is going to snag. He's going to hang on to that synergy for round three. Oh, tries to see ADC grab. But uh, canceled into a flight stance. It's going to work out. The 5X is going to snag. Not able to combo off of it that time. And some time through the Flare Blitz. Oh, Flare Blitz with its lasting hitboxes. Snagging the vulnerable frames. Goes for the grab. Goes for burst of activation. That's real activating his burst as well. Goes for his burst, Zephyrl, that is. And Rassi's going to go and activate his, but that will get blocked in time. Yeah. It'll land his counterattack against Flare Blitz. Trying to go for the cross up. They're kind of in a tight spot here. Dragonite call out. Oh, it's going to catch him at the last second to give him the opportunity to land the Hydro Pump. Rasmu taking it 3-2.